Hey everybody, I'm back, and guess what I went and did? <laughs> I picked up another Hair Adorable uh, Series 3 uh, from the store. I figured, I hate taking the risk, but I looked at the checklist the other day, or just even just before I started this video, and they all look so cool, and I want all of them. Unfortunately, I have stomped out my completionist with this series, because sometimes you just can't get them all. Not unless you're willing to pay big big bucks um, aftermarket for them. But, since I have only gotten one, uh, my chances of getting a double here is slim. I, I, so I'm hoping to get somebody new today. Uh, I, I have my eyes on all of them, so... Oh, what's this here? I didn't realize there was a tear strip in the middle. Okay, so there's a tear strip in the middle of the plastic. Guess you learn new things every day. So yeah, I'm gonna get her open. There are 39 to collect in this series. It's a bigger series than series two. It's almost like series two was an in the middle series just to get ready for this one. Although there were some pretty nice ones out of series two. All right, so we get the plastic removed. Like I said in my previous video, it opens up a different way this season. And then I think this part opens too. Um, how does the rest of it open? It just opens up. Like that. I think this just rips off here. And we'll see what we have on the inside. See if it's different. No. So we do have the same backdrop that I got in the last one. I better not have a double on my second. I'm going to be so mad. If I have a double on my second, I swear I quit. <laughs> but um, we're going to go ahead and um, pop these up because these are cool little pop-ups they have now. Like, you know how they always, they've always had play boxes in them. Uh, but these ones, I think, are a little different and cool. So let's go in here. We're going to go to number one. Again, there's no drawers in these ones. They're set up a little bit different, and the bags are a little bit more snazzier, I think. So let's see what we have for our first prize. We have... Shoes with wings. Transparent pink with painted on pink wings and pink laces. And here is our signature sticker. Door number two. This one's a big. This is a big bag. I wonder where this could be. This is probably the hair extension. So they all have them, I think, in this series. Let's see. Come on out of there, guy. Ooh, they're wings. I don't know who we have here, but I wonder if it's a willow. But uh, their wings, it was a big package. They're white, uh, almost, yeah, they're like pearlescent white. And there's a little attachment there for them to go on our doll. Is that all that was in there? Yep. I guess that's why the bag was big. That's our third one here. There's another big bag. It's weird, the big bags have tear strips and the small bags don't. So it's kind of weird. This must be our hair extension. Let's see. And a sticker. So our so our hair extension is a bubblegum pink, and it looks like either it looks like a bee, guys. So I, now I'm really confused as to what who this is. The bee is kind of a sparkly gold. It's like a gold, transparent gold with uh, sparkles embedded in it, and the pink. Looks like it has a different color pink in there. I wonder if it's a color changer. I think this is a color changer. <laughs> Let's see. So, And we also got a sticker somewhere. Ah, here we go. Here's a sticker. It looks like a rain, maybe. And our fourth surprise we got here. Blaze wants to help. Don't you, Blaze? Blaze. 
a big one too. Oh, but this big one doesn't have a tear strip. Hmm. Um, so here's our hair piece. Uh, it looks like there's a dragonfly. Is that what the dragonfly? No. Oh, so uh, it must. This must be an outdoors one, I think. So um, there's like a sponge type applicator there with. I don't. I wonder if this is supposed to be look like a like a a hair. Uh, when you dye your hair, the little brush that you put to streak. So I'm I'm really now thinking that this is a color changer, a hair piece. But uh, here, let's go ahead and take a look at our actual doll. Let's see what's in here. Did I get this to open here? Um, I think we did get a willow, guys. She's really pretty. Um, let me grab out her card here. So, yep, we got Willow, guys. So the card says, Bedtime Routine, Selecting Fashions, Favorite Flower is Adelia, and Signature Dance Move is Unicorn Dance. Okay, you guys, I am pretty excited with this girl. Okay, so I have her all made up. I looked her up. This is, her name is Whirling Willow, and she is a color changer. This part color changes. I don't know if you can see that. I can actually change it with my hands. It changes to a, a white color from the pink and then changes back with cold. So it eventually would change back on its own. Um, she is from the Signature series and uh, she is a color changer. Did I say that? I'll edit it if I did. Anyhow, this is her little wand. So you're actually supposed to put this in warm water and just drag it through her hair. You can do that. Um, I did clip it on. Took a look at her actual hair itself. She, the, this part right here, her bangs are parted and they're held in by like a tie. You can cut that off and remove it if you want, but I won't because I am a collector. So it's parted in the middle and there actually is a little bit of um, product put on these to keep them from fuzzing out. Which I think is a first with hair adorables. The rest of her hair is super soft and it's back in a ponytail with a little bit of curl. I mean, a, in a braid. A little bit of curl. The color is really soft pastel pink and blue. It almost reminds me of maybe like a cotton candy or like a whimsical type uh, color situation. Very subtle. Uh, I put her wings on, so those are on her. I put them around her waist. It's a little bit difficult getting them on because her dress is a little bit of a thick fabric. But uh, they went on. She. Um, as you guys noticed, she's actually one of the darker complexion ones. Willow always has been uh, more of a tan color. She has dark brown eyebrows, blue eyes that look forward, that have a little tint of pink in them. And uh, she has a little tiny bit of pink eyeshadow. If you guys can look close at that. It's a little bit of a darker pink than her hair. She has um, like a plum colored lips. I also do believe that this head mold is a new head mold for Series 3. She almost looks like she's puckering up and giving you a kiss. Uh, um, our, as for articulation, her head moves back and forth, her arms move up and down. Uh, they do have different arms, for style arms for different girls throughout the series, uh, but they do always move up and down and back and forth. They're on a little bit of a joint. Uh, her legs move up and down and apart as well and she does come with this great translucent pink stand which is nice uh, her dress is um, a like a really light blue with uh, sequins that are also done in blue um, done as a stripe as a horizontal stripe uh, so I think that looks really cute and it does velcro come off uh, underneath her She's actually wearing a bathing suit. It's a metallic pink. If you guys can see that at all. Metallic pink bathing suit. That is strapless. Uh, and that's basically all we have for you guys today. So I'm excited to add her to my Hair Adorables collection. And um, stay tuned. I do have a couple more to open. So stay tuned after this video. Uh, 
If you like this video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and hopefully we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.